Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. This is Scout Pilot coming to you from his shop in the woods. One of my YouTube subscribers has asked me to explain my orange box. Well, this is a remote starter that I use for my CJ5 because everywhere I work on this CJ5 is on the passenger side and the starter switch is on the driver's side. All right. So we use the Snap-on MT345A, which I picked up on eBay for inexpensive price. Simple, works on six and 12 volt. Three position switch to control it. Center off, top test, bottom run. The starter button and the indicator light. The indicator light allows you to check the battery. All right. Now with this particular unit, I can motor the engine in order to set the points without firing the ignition. That's a good thing. All right. Snap-on was kind enough to supply directions on how to hook it up. If you got any questions, you can always check with me. All right, we're gonna follow these leads out. Three wires in this particular unit. First is your red wire. That's your power, connects to the positive side of the battery. Next is the green, which connects to the battery side of the resistor. All right, that's the output right there. Two wires at the bottom come from the ignition and the battery. One wire at the top goes to the coil. You can see it right there at the bottom. All right, then you get down further and you have the black lead, which connects to, get down there, connects to the solenoid. All right, perhaps you can see it. It's right there. Okay, so I'm tired, I've been working all week long. All right, so with it hooked up like that, I can motor it, I can start it, which I don't really want to do at this point. Okay, well, let's move on to some other, so that y'all understand them. The vacuum gauge, very important in my work. Should be important in yours for keeping your motor in, in top condition. This checks the vacuum of the motor. Here is the connection to my intake manifold so that I can check everything. All right, this is the PCV. This is from the vacuum pump. And lastly, we have the multimeter. This one too is made by Snap-on, picked up on eBay, as was the vacuum gauge. This gives me four, six, and eight cylinders, gives me two settings for RPM, shows me the dwell and the ohms. All right, it hooks up very simply. It's got a ground wire that connects to the negative terminal of the battery, and it has a positive wire, which has fallen off and is right here, yellow, and that connects to the hot lead on the distributor. Okay, I apologize for this being shaky, but uh, I am kind of tired, like I say. All right, well, that's it. I'll put this up for you. Thanks.